Ah, King Jason. Your recent trial was enlightening. I am Lysias, adjudicator for the Merchants Guild on Mycenae. Tell me, Lysias, have you noticed anything unusual in the market? Can't say I have. The only matter of note is a dispute between two of our merchants. You're used to hearing petitions at your court. I wonder if you'd help me. Two merchants, Forus and Hegestratus, argue over... I've met those men, and heard something of the matter of... I'm in an awkward situation. I was the one who ultimately bought the vase from Hegestratus, you see. Now, I must decide the matter. I'd be grateful for... I can offer my counsel. <sighs> Thank you. You say you've met these men. Uh, I am. So, as you see it, the spirit of the contract favors the seller, Hegestratus. But the words favor the buyer for us. Both men have a valid claim. If it were my decision, I'd have the two men split the profit from the sale in equal parts. Yes. Each would then come out ahead. I doubt either will be fully satisfied, but justice will thank you, King Jason. I appreciate your insight. I'll tell you how the Nasiros handle such disputes. The two merchants would take turns punching each other in the face until one yielded his claim. That's right, boys. Origin's coin is good, and I'm taking all comers. Origen, son of Hippia. Who's asking? My name's Jason. I've spoken to your mother. Good for you. I've spoken to her, too. Now, you here to play or chat about my relatives? I'm here to learn where I can find the stork. You're going to tell me, one way or another. Or what? You'll kill me? Just like the stork will do if I give you what you want? Kichita, boy. We don't have time for this. I'm sorry. I fail to see how that's my problem. You will tell me what I want to know. The only question is how much persuasion it's going to take to get you to talk. All right, all right. I'll tell you what. If you win, I'll tell you what. And if... Then I won't. Oh, and you'll go back to dear old mom and tell her you saw me making a devotion here. Game of wits, you say? Right. A simple game to test with. Here's how it'll work. I pick the game, and you choose who plays first. That way, it's fair. Hope you're feeling lucky, boy. What's the game? The game's a simple one. As old as the hills. It's called Eleven. We'll each take turns playing a number between one and four. Each time a number's played, it's added to the total. Whoever hits exactly eleven wins. If you play to a number over 11, you lose. Simple, isn't it? So tell me, do you want to play first or second? I'll play second. You first, Origin. Then let's begin. To start, I'll play two. That means the total is two. Your turn. I play four. And so the total is six. I play one. That brings the total to seven. Your turn. I play one. And so the total is eight, which means I, of course, play three, bringing the total to eleven. It seems I win. Don't be too hard on yourself. Slight exaggeration. I can't wait to hear you tell my mom how I've been... I need his look. We just went over that. We played, you lost. That... New deal. You tell me what I want to know. I let you... Talk about a sore loser. Your answer. You're a terrible gambler. You know that? The stork operates out of the slums. He's got a little rag stick. 
He's an Egyptian. He calls himself Khufu. But be discreet. If you even hint that I told you, I'm... We'll say nothing. I've made worse wages before. I think. Now leave me be, would you? I'm good, sir. A cool I have no interest in either. But what does the stork have to say? So, you've learned my little secret. Was it Orit? He's not to blame. Origin is in no danger. I forgive his debts. I'm actually pleased he sent you here. I think we can help each other. But first, what can the stork do for you? There are black tongues on Mycenae. Have you heard anything? Rumors. Whispers in the streets. Where do you get your information from? Khufu cares for many boys. You'd be surprised how easily a child can slip by unnoticed where important people talk. Other rumors too. Honorable Patroclus speaks with Ionians in private. I wonder what about. Those mercenaries fight in the arena. What's so strange about that? I hear Patroclus offered a contract to an Ionian champion named Doka. No one's seen a champion of Ionia. They don't leave their homeland. Stranger still, only one man has entered the tournament. Who do you think it is? The Ionian champion. Correct. Dokan is unopposed. Not even Achilles has agreed to fight. Does everyone fear this Ionian? Even Achilles? May I suggest you put that question to Patroclus? Now, you have been given something of value, yes? I would expect something of value in return. What is it you want? I could care less if the Ionian wins or loses. Business goes on. But if there's only one fighter, we don't have a tournament. No tournament, no gambling. No gambling, no business for Khufu. You could convince Achilles to enter the tournament. Why? So you can... T Think on this. If Achilles wins, Mycenae would proud. If Dokkan wins, there will be civil war. I hate to agree with him. But he's right, Jason. Very well. We'll go speak to Patroclus and Achilles. Something doesn't add up here. Humble gratitude. Khufu keep little spies work hard. If Khufu learn more, little spy come to you. King Jason. Feel a bit. And you did what you said. And watched. You saw. After it stopped rolling, it just. It just stared. There's no glory in killing for sports. So much blood. But that's the life of the arena fight. I thought that's what you wanted. You would want so much. Sign up. It's time for you to go home. Find the next Yolkin vessel and tell them by my order to take you back. When you get home, report to the palace. The palace? I seem to recall an opening for a junior apprentice quartermaster. Sounds important. Oh, it is. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Are there beasts in this arena? Forcing captured animals to fight is cr cool. The man of 
Lysenay can't win forever! Only cargo past this point. Maybe one of you lot will be the Yes, would it? I'd like to see your... So what if you do? It's important. You're a king hey, and you've proven your innocence. Women. I can't just ignore them. What exactly is it you want to know? Have you seen anything suspicious in the like king. Any strange passengers coming ashore? We note every arrival on Mycenae. Apart from yourself and the Ionians, there is nothing out of the ordinary. The documents will tell you as much. You see them? The reports are given to Captain Akiki, and if you've met Captain Akiki, you know he won't release them unless you had approval from the entire Senate. I wouldn't hold your breath. Athena herself would appear on Mycenae before that one. In the arena, you'll be famous. I'm sorry. I cannot help you obtain those reports. But I can tell you, I see nothing that would suggest a threat to Mycenae. And I inspect every ship that comes to port. I'll give it to you for free! Very well, Dark Sister. display as usual Achilles yes yes send the girls ah King Jason congratulations on a most entertaining trial I must admit I was surprised at how it ended but my prophet soon eased the sting of that shock I hear Achilles hasn't entered like Amidi's tournament. I'm not a slaver. If the man doesn't want to fight, I can't force him. Achilles is a great warrior, perhaps the best. But can you really see him? I also hear you have a new fighter under contract. An Ionian fighter. I'm always in the market for exotic talent. Have you seen him? No. An amazing specimen. I'm not sure the people of Mycenae will share your high opinion of him, should he win. Mycenae is first and foremost the land of Ares. The strongest should rule, foreigner or not. The people will understand. You've got the chance to hold the biggest tournament in the history of Mycenae and you're letting it pass? You're up to something, Patroclus. I know it. My good king, you just completed a trial by combat. Do you really wish to suffer through another by slandering my good name? Now I bid you... Sinde Seca. That man's a snake. Let's go back below and speak to Achilles. I want to hear for myself why he won't fight. Workshop and champion's quarters lie inside. Do you seek passage? I do. Raise the gate! Achilles! Achilles, it's Jason. Oh, where are you going, Achilles? Come back. 
What is it? I am preoccupied at the moment. Why are you not fighting in the tournament? Achilles, tell the wine bearer to leave it at the door. <laughs> We're waiting. Then fill your cups and wait some more. What business is it of yours if I fight or not? Who rules this kingdom is the business of everyone on Mycenae. Huh. <laughs> what need have I of a crown? What need have I of the fist of Ares? Let the Ionians sit on a throne and bandy words with merchants and farmers. That sounds like Tartarus to me. Do you really think wine and women will keep you satisfied forever? You throw your life away in this room. Remember who you speak to. I am Achilles. Listen to the people. When I stride upon the arena floor, you'd think Ares himself had appeared before them. Don't you see, Jason? I'll be remembered as the greatest fighter the world has ever seen. The greatest? You're nothing, Achilles. You sit here growing soft, sparring with the desperate and the criminal. It takes courage to aspire to greatness. Only a coward sits content with an easy life. Save your breath. You want to stop the Ionian from winning? Fight him yourself. Then you can have two kingdoms to muck up. Achilles, we're bored. Come back to us. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to receive my therapy. Achilles! What is he thinking? <sighs> what now, Jason? We must keep searching. We have to find those black tongues. We could see if Senator Anaxagoras has turned up anything new. Or the guardsman Alexius at Ares Watch. He seemed willing to help. And there's always Khufu. Perhaps his spies have found something. We won't find them standing here. Come. You're Jason from Ilicus? I'm Bolo. And I've... a couple of the other boys found out the Ionians registered some car... I thought these Ionians were mercenaries. What would they be trading? There's more! Stork said, be sure to tell... Who then? None other than Captain Akikios himself. Stork says captains don't usually do guardsmen's work. I think we need to pay Captain Akikios another visit. Oh, I gotta go! I'm not back in ten minutes. It's a beating for sure. Khufu has no right to beat you. Next time he tries, leave. Easy for you to say. You've got a great big ship to take you anywhere you want to go. If only there was some place I could go where I could sing for my supper. Khufu says singing is for birds. Says it'll make me a bad pickpocket. If I leave Khufu, what then? I suppose I could take that job as a barnacle scraper. I don't know what that is exactly. What you need is a family. There's a couple of very nice people, I think. People? Uh, I don't... Their names are Pythias and Zosme. Uh... They love music, Bolo. Pythias plays the lyre. They... The market is on my way back. I'll stop by. Think they're going to get along, Jason? I think they'll make a fine family. Achilles calls tournament second great attraction. King Jason. Gets more interesting by the minute. Is he ever? He just relieved me. Said he was meeting someone, so I might as well call it a day. Ten years in the guard. First time I've been sent home early. Not that I'm complaining. Who's he meeting with? Didn't say. He was alone when I left him. Ares, watch over you. What of my reward? 
I was promised a place in the new order. Reward is knowing you have served not enough. Then let me send you to paradise. <laughs> Black tongues! Don't let them get away! this leave us? We know the Black Tongues are here, and we know they want to kill Lycomedes. Akikyo said they planned to strike during the tournament. Makes sense. With Lycomedes in seclusion, it may be the last time anyone's sure to see him in public. Plenty of places in the stands to take a clean shot into the royal box. Wouldn't be hard. There's another way they could do it. How do you figure? Lycomedes will personally hand the Fist of Ares to the winner of his tournament. How much do we really know about this Sionian champion, Dokkan? He'd have the perfect opportunity to strike an unwitting Lycomedes! We can't let that happen. We can tell the Guard, the Senate, Lycomedes himself. He has to call off the tournament! You heard Akikios. The Guard is compromised. And for all we know, so is the Senate. Lycomedes is in seclusion. I doubt he'll see us. No. It falls to us to stop this. What do you have in mind, Jason? It would seem my time as a gladiator is not yet finished. Looks like there'll be a tournament after all. I'll take care of Dokkan. One way or another, he won't threaten Lycomedes. That leaves the stands to the both of you. We can get Pan to help as well. Between us all, Lycomedes must not fall. Everything Use depends on that. Merchant Understood. We'd better hurry then, and get you signed up to fight. There's the recruiter at the docks. Or we could go straight to Patroclus in the arena. We'll send word that I'm entering the tournament. To the arena. To hand Fist of Ares to tournament winner. Final public appearance for the king. If I may say so, you fought well, sir. Ares smiles on you. I've just been telling little Bolo here that I'm going to teach him to play the lyre. And he's going to teach me some of the songs he knows. That's right. And we're going to Massalonia together. Massalia, Bolo. Right, Malasia. We're leaving tomorrow. Thank you, Jason. Truly, you've been a blessing. I'm happy for you all. May you find fortune wherever you go.
Fighters like kings! People are still talking about that match with Achilles. I knew you had the heart of a gladiator. Here to sign up for the tournament. What? You'd fight for the Fist of Ares. Are you sure that's wise, sir? Jason of Yolkus, mark it on your roster. As... as you said, Patrick List will be very... surprised at this news. And so it's done. Shall we head straight for the arena? Yes, to the arena. again for the last time I sent your friend so I heard <laughs> here's hoping he enjoys his tr once he figures out he's been duped he'll be back I'll need to be long gone before then time to move on I suppose speaking of which I hear you have quite a ship Jason the Argo built by master Argos I don't boast in saying I've never seen her equal. There wouldn't happen to be room aboard for a forge, would there? I think we could make room for a forge if we knew we had a good man to work it. How about the world's foremost genius? That good enough for you? Welcome aboard, Daedalus. A moving workshop. What better way to keep ahead of King Minos' agents? First, we have a tournament to Oh, I'm not too worried about that. You can take this Ionian. There's a bigger concern than the Ionian. We found black tongues on Mycenae. They were smuggled aboard the Ionian ship. They planned to kill Lycomedes during this tournament. During the tournament? The Argonauts will be watching the crowd. Can I rely on you to help me keep an eye on Patroclus and Dokkan? Of course. What do you need to know about the tournament? Do you know? Yeah, he's don't expect to see humans in your first match. Speaking of, are you ready to start? The Argonauts are in place outside. Let's see what he has in Very well. I'll <coughs> In far off sorry. In the depths of the steamy wine. Live a band of murderous savages, fearsome and refined. A pagan throng of man-eaters who fight with cunning guile. <laughs> For proof, just ask the men they butchered, or the women whom they... Citizens of Mycenae, I give to you! King Jason's first test! I give to you! <laughs> By the will of Ares! Begin! Thank <laughs> you. 
Citizens, you'll not want to miss what's next. Jason, attend closely. Asclepius thinks Patroclus might resort to dirty tactics this next fight. You should speak with him, but perhaps I can help. Not long ago, Patroclus agreed to fund a number of my more experimental projects. This sword was an interesting byproduct of an byproduct. I didn't work. I hold a sword stronger and sharper than any the world has seen. And he said, "What can you tell me about something's afoot? All I've heard is you'll face a single minute." I know Patroclus's wranglers have found a particularly nasty specimen. I'd be ready for surprises, Jason. Not quite yet.
be ready for surprises, Jason. Let's go spring Patroclus' trap. Then I'll inform that snake we're ready to begin. Attention, citizens of Mycenae! The Tournament of Champions continues! Shall we? Three fiends to shake the very foundations of this arena! Will this finally be enough to stop King Jason? It better be. Men and women of Mycenae! I give you the Minotaur! <laughs> By the will of Ares, begin! Tremendous performance! It appears our final match is set. Jason versus Dokkan! Yolkus versus Ionia! A finale to end all finales! A fight that the gods themselves will be watching! Easy, Jason. Easy. Patroclus released a poison through the trap doors when the Minotaurs came out. Those brutes wouldn't feel it, but you certainly did. How you managed to keep fighting is beyond all comprehension. Thank you, Asclepius. If it wasn't for your aid, I wouldn't have made it this far. Jason, in all my years, I've been a neutral observer to the carnage that plays out here. If I've hoped for anything, it was for quick deaths and light wounds. I never thought I'd say this, but now I hoped for your victory.
That cheating bastard Patroclus. Thank the gods for Asclepius. You can't avoid a showdown any longer. Only Dokkan remains. This is it then. If the Black Tongues are going to make their move, it'll be during this match. Make for the Argo once it starts, Daedalus. You should be able to slip away unnoticed. But you may need me here. The strike will come from the stands, or from Dokkan himself. You can't help either way. We're going to get you on the Argo without King Minos's man noticing. This is our chance. You're right. Very well. Are you ready then? Yes. Lycomedes must not fall. I'll let Patroclus know, and then I'll slip away. Be careful, Jason. May the gods be with you. Attention, citizens of Mycenae! The final match of the Tournament of Champions is about to begin! And now, my friends, what more can I say? The words elude! A silver tongue does not suffice. No, one would need a tongue of the finest gold to do this moment justice. So I ask you to look down upon these men who will fight before us! Jason, King of Yotas! Dokkan, Champion of Ionia! Man against man! Achilles? Ah! Black Armenians! Black Armenians! Are you not still king of this land? Do the people of Greece ignore the rules of battle? Get up! Old King, tell this robber their pet must return to his cage! People do not serve me who holds the Fist of Ares. He who holds the Fist of Ares serves the people, and they have spoken! Achilles, fight! Then you will all die! Champions truly fight! May Ares guide your hand, champion of Bison. May Ares smile upon you, King of Yotas. Jason! For Hecate!
say something. You forgive an old fool. Twice now I have wronged you without cause. You need the blood of Ares. I offer you every drop I have. Achilles, what are you doing here? It's your lucky day, Jason. I've decided to join in your journey. Your spear would be welcome, Achilles. But do you know what we seek? The Golden Fleece. Glory enough to share, I think. If that's what you're after, you'll get your fill before we're through. I promise you that. I'll hold you to it. How many winches do you have aboard? Please tell me you've got more than this little wood nymph. Ichi, Bunkani, Takuni. You should get that looked at. What about your wine, Jason? I trust your stores are ample. Welcome aboard, Achilles. Argonauts, to the ship. Jason. I want to talk to you. The Fist of Ares has been in my family since the chariot rider himself bestowed it to us. To think I almost gave it away as a tournament prize. What a fool I was. What I should have done was give it to you the moment you arrived on my side. Better late than never. The Fist of Ares belongs to the King of Mycenae. As I said, it belongs in my family. Alcime is my only child. It would pass to her son, to your son. Keep it for him, and when he is of age, tell him how you won it in a tournament. The king, the arena fighter, and the smith. All three have joined his crew. Why do people flock to him and his fool's quest? Leave us! My dear, what are we going to do with your husband? Of course, I should have killed you when you were just a girl, running through the palace. You were always such a... A pretty girl. The dear old brother. Jason's father didn't trust me. Sent me away. And Lycomedes had his armies looking in every bush in Greece for black tongues. No, the time wasn't right. But now... My dear, your husband is not going to find the fleece. But even if he does, there won't be an Alcime left to use it on. Damn you, Jason!